Um, I've got my camera tipped down a little bit so you can see these mirrors that I got on. I hope you can see them. I guess we'll find out when I get home and check the footage. Um, trying them out, giving them a shot. They seem to be pretty good so far. What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. I have another unboxing, installation, and product review for you today. I have the uh, Kemimoto bike mirrors here. Uh, I've been wanting to get something for the flex so that I can, you know, see what's going on to my side and behind me. And I think this is going to be uh, just the right thing. Handlebars are a little crowded on uh, the Zeus bikes, but I think there's space. We might even be able to go under and mount them a little different too. So let's unbox this and see what's inside. Looks like one of the mirrors. The other mirror. Some tools and the connector pieces that connect the mirrors themselves to what I assume are the brackets. Yep, and right here, these are the brackets that go on the bars. All right, let's install it, see how it goes. Just quickly, here is a closer look at the brackets. Um, these are nicely made, they're metal. Um, they're not plastic, so you don't have to worry about snapping them if you torque it down a little bit too hard. You know, one thing I'll say is that uh, you might want to put some padding, some sticky padding in there. I have some weather stripping that I'm going to use. That way the metal doesn't um, kink your bars if you, sw if you tighten it up too much. So as you can see, my handlebars are a little bit crowded, a little bit busy um, between the throttle, the brake lever, and then I got to get the content. So I got this camera mount here, bracket. So what I'm gonna to try to do is get them on this bar here and then have them come out to the side this way and underneath the grips. Uh, so I've got one in place just to see how it looks. I, I just thumb tightened it, not all the way tight. And um, I'll install the other one over here and see how it goes. There were no instructions with the, um, with the mirrors, but there is a video on the Amazon channel that will show you how to install. All right, now that I got these finger tight and lined up where I want them, I'm gonna torque them down a little bit with the tool they provided. Do a little bit at a time on each. That way you don't over tighten one down and make it uneven. So I found that it's easier to just assemble the whole thing first and then mount it to the bar, um, just based on how crowded my bars are. And then the other way you could do it is just spin them on while you have the clamp already attached. So if you have the clearance, like my, my bar is a little bit in the way, but if you have the clearance, you can just bend them right on. All right, so now that I got these babies installed, 
it is time to go try them out on the street. Here we go. Kamimoto bicycle mirrors. Hopefully you could see them in the, uh, in the video. I got my camera tipped downward a little bit more so than I usually do so that you could see them on the handlebars and get a sense for um, the kind of benefit they provide. So uh, I adjusted them a little bit. I can see pretty well to my flank. Pretty good. So they're not in the ideal position, obviously. It's best if they're coming off like the top uh, and going like over my hands because then there's no obstructed view you know for what you're looking at in the mirror however um, for a BMX bike um, my head's on a swivel a lot of times anyway so um, these are really just like a supplemental item for me they do the job that I need them to do when um, when I need to focus on the road ahead as I mentioned when I was installing them and putting them, you know, doing the unboxing, these were really meant to be for um, the Ultraflex. Because the Ultraflex has a little bit more room for me up on top for me to put things. Um, and uh, it sits a little bit higher, so I think it would have a better effect. I think it would work better for me than these ones on the 1100. It sits a little bit lower. So we'll see. I'll switch them out once I get that battery going and uh, update this review then. But for now, this is a good product. I like it. If you're looking for mirrors, um, these are really nice. They have uh, good reflective quality. The image isn't too bent up and, um, you know, warped. You know, like some cheap mirrors, they, they can warp the image. This one is pretty good, true to life. So yeah, Kamimoto, bicycle mirrors, I'm a fan.